So yesterday I went down and picked up my Bluetooth dongle and my wireless Wii sensor bar for the Dolphin emulator on the PC. Now I'm going to show you how to connect the Wiimote to the PC through Dolphin emulator, but you have to have Bluetooth and a wireless Wii sensor bar for this to work. Alright, so I'm going to go to my gaming desktop. I have DeskSpace Pro found from some other YouTube video, but... Open up the Dolphin emulator, close that folder, let's uh, drag this down, make it go full screen. Now we go Wiimote, connected to zero Wiimote. You can see I have a Bluetooth thingy down there, Bluetooth dongle. Alright, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to press the red sync button, all lights will start blinking, you click pair up, and it's going to take a second, and we should get a little thing down here. Installing device driver, Bluetooth peripheral device, searching Windows update. Bluetooth HID device ready to use. Close. Click refresh. Your Wiimote will vibrate and you are connected. Now, if this doesn't work for you, leave a comment and I will try to figure out why not. Alright, so, I've already got my Dolphin set up. See, I have four games, all of which I own a copy of, which I highly suggest you do before you download the ISO. Copyright laws, blah, 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 blah. Alright, and also you can see I have Wii Fit Plus because I have an, a, a real Wii and I have Wii Fit Plus for it, but I can't get the Wii Fit board or what Wii Balance board, whatever the hell it is, to work with the Dolphin emulator, so we're just going to kind of play this one. Alright, so we load it up, we go, we try to pop it full screen. It'll start up, and then you press A on the Wiimote, and if it changes, you know you got your Wii Mote set up, right? Alright, and as you can see, yes, this is a, with a Wiimote. Amazing! Alright, so we press A. This annoying little dude will start talking. Ah, blah, 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 blah. Yeah! I'm Trevor, not my cousin Michael, who's in the background. I'm sure you'll hear him. I'm gonna punch him. Alright. I'm sorry I'm blabbling. Yeah, you always are. So, it'll start loading. By the way, this is Animal Crossing City Folk. I don't know why I think it's a great game, but I think it is a great game. Let me reach over, grab my nunchuck. Alright, sorry about that. I had to do a little edit on the video, but... Continuing from my where I was, we're gonna use the little nunchuck thing to walk around. Just kinda check the city out. So, pretty basic. I need to hire a gardener somehow. Got too many of these weeds, but... Yeah, you can see my awesome pink bed head because the lady that does hairdressing doesn't warn you she's going to dye your hair pink. Yeah, thanks. The shirt's probably looking pretty gay, but that's what I got for now. I just started this game. So, walking around, you can see Wiimote works perfectly using Z to pull up all these weeds. We'll walk over to a tree, shake it with C. You can pick up the stuff with the Z. You can do little donuts. Alright, now we're going to reach over, grab the Wiimote, and you can see, you can walk around with this, blah 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 Pretty cool. Walk over to a tree, let's, uh, let's see, what is it, A? B to shake the trees, what is it? It's A. Alright, walk over, grab the stuff with B. As you can see, it works pretty basic. Left and right arrows work. So far, I haven't found a button that doesn't work, including, ta-da! thought this was pretty cool. I didn't expect that to still work. Of course, when you click on Wii menu, it gives you an error. It might not if you know how to get the Wii menu channel thingy set up, but it doesn't work for me. So, we can go Wiimote settings. Turn the audio up. Although, I don't think that really works. Not sure. Rumble on off. That does work. Reconnect. Well, let's just not mess with that. Reset. Probably don't want to press that. Probably don't want to press that. Let's close this. Alright, so we're back in the game, running around, la di da di da Pretty cool, yeah. But yeah, that's the basics of Dolphin Emulator. Just pretty much click that pair up, the little sync button, start the game up. Now, you can also watch my videos on how to get the Dolphin Emulator. 
and how to get the ISOs for the game. But I must stress for copyright laws, buy the game before you download the ISO. Still not legal, but way less illegal. If you have an LG what is it DVD drive I've heard those work with the Wii games but most others don't I don't have one so I don't know how that whole thing works but you can probably find a program to rip the game create your own ISO and that is completely legal as long as you keep the ISO to yourself alright so we're gonna say bye to this little dude driver bye alright we're gonna click and save so we don't quit Saving, save complete. Look how fast that was. Amazing, isn't it? Alright, let's close this. And my Sims, Sims 2 Cast Away. This game is... I don't know if it was my download of the game or what, but this game doesn't quite work right. My Sims, unless you have the Wiimote, is a pain in the butt to use, so if you don't have the Wiimote, you probably don't want to spend your money on this game.